I think that this is a beautiful um, coincidence that we celebrate Polish Independence Day on the 11th of November, the day that is celebrated here in America as the, as the Veterans Day. And I, I, think, I don't think that um, it could be more fitting to remember uh, of all of those who throughout the centuries of very complex and difficult history of Poland proved through their fight, um, not words, but deeds. Uh, Ms. Helen Knapczyk, a witness and survi survivor of the horrors of Siberia, was born in Niedźwiedzia in eastern Poland. On February 10, 1940, at age 13, Helena and her family were held at gunpoint by Russian soldiers at their home and ordered to leave during a harsh winter. After six weeks of grueling travel in cattle cars, they arrived in Siberia, Siberian Taiga, where Helena experienced devastating labor camps and the deaths of her closest family members and friends. Two years later, Helena was separated from her family and sent to orphanages in Iran, Asia, and East, Eastern Africa. After World War II, Helena was transferred to England, to Nottingham, where she met her future husband, Vincente Knapczyk. Freedom and independence is never given. Probably there is no other nation um, but Polish nation that is so much devoted to this fight for democracy and for the freedom for ourselves and for everyone surrounding us.